So after pulling out of two of the three big events so far on the clay court season, Carlos Alcaraz has forced a withdraw again, this time from Rome. And that is really the last preparations for the French Open going in to uh, the second major of the year. Let's go have a look at what he had to say over on social media. This is what he wrote on Twitter. I felt after playing in Madrid, discomfort in my arm. Today I had some tests and I have a muscle edema in the pronated teres, a consequence of my last injury. Unfortunately, I won't be able to play in Rome. I need to rest to recover and be able to play 100% pain-free. So there it is, Elgris out of Rome, and he's not the only one who is in doubt for Rome. Of course, Medvedev withdrawing from his match yesterday after hurting his leg. We all know about the hip with Sinner as well, who also withdrew from Madrid this week. So on the men's side, everybody's falling apart, and Djokovic is just coming back right on time while everyone's getting injured. So, I mean, great for Djokovic, especially if he can maybe avoid some of these guys that have been giving him troubles this year. Maybe he can go on and win the French Open yet again, and first of all, play Rome and maybe win that. But man... What a blow for Carlos, who's only had Madrid to prepare for the French Open. Of course, the Olympics is going to be on clay as well. So, man, not a great preparation for the Spaniard. But let me know down the comments below. Who else is going to join Alcaraz on the withdrawal list? Because on the men's side, he's obviously the biggest one. Rafa, he doesn't know what he's going to do on the clay in Rome. If he's going to go or not, he said he wants to, but you never know. I mean, Sinner, is he going to play? I know it's in Italy, but is he going to play? Medvedev as well. But a massive withdrawal from Rome with Alcaraz pulling out.